worldwide great backyard bird count. This is a uh, program that's a joint effort between Audubon and Cornell Lab of Ornithology and a couple of other conservation organizations. And basically the whole idea is we all get together on this weekend and we count as many birds as we can and we log all of our data and it's like this massive citizen science effort and scientists will use the data that is submitted by the public to help, uh, to help them figure out trends in bird populations. Um, are, they, are birds facing any declines because of urbanization or climate change? Are they changing their migration patterns? Um, are, they, is, are there invasive species that are kind of taking over the, the native species in an area? So there's so much information we can learn about birds based on the data that we all submit. Because scientists can't be everywhere at any given time, so we kind of become the scientists, which is really kind of neat. His bill is really long. That's for eating insects that are hiding inside the bark of trees. Anybody else want to head home? Any new guessers? White breasted nut hatch. So it does feed like a woodpecker. So if you ever see a bird upside down on the trunk of a tree, it's a very good chance that it's a white breasted nut hatch. <laughs> Cooper's is bigger, Sharpshin is tiny. We are looking out the uh, windows of our museum and we're looking for birds that are coming to the feeders. And this is the backyard of the museum and we've got a really good view from our windows here. So we're gonna record all the birds that we see. <laughs> but a bird barn is just kind of neat because you can you can hide yourself basically. Yeah. And the birds don't really know that you're there unless you have somebody talking like me. So I'll be quiet. why the feeders are so high? It's for the bears. Maybe it was just... What we do is we, we sign in. If you've never done the backyard bird count, like you might have to sign in as a new user. Just go ahead and raise your hand if you've got data. I'm going to start with one person's list. You tell me what you've got and then we'll add to it. So go ahead, sweetheart. Tell me what you got. One blue jay. Anything else? If you go on to eBird, ebird.org, they you can record your findings all year long, 24/7, um, and they would love to get any data that you have to submit. So, and you can even get get an eBird app. Thank mm -hmm. you.